In this presentation, we'll review the included components and basic operation for the Dactronics Announcers Interface. The Dactronics Push to Talk Announcers Interface provides a single point location to control voice announcements. The rugged, powder coated steel housing ensures that the interface stands up to more than everyday wear and tear. Included with the assembly is the Announcers Interface Box, Gooseneck, Dynamic Vocal Microphone, 12 volt AC wall pack transformer, a 15 foot XLR cable to interface to an audio control system, and a pair of headphones. Looking at the top of the interface, we have the microphone input location, where normally we would plug in the supplied XLR gooseneck and microphone. There is a headphone volume control to control the master volume of the audio coming into the headphones. Next is a mic live LED indicator. This indicates when the microphone is live. Then there is a continuous button. Press this button once to activate the microphone for continuous operation. Last, the momentary button. Press and hold down this button to activate the microphone. On the rear of the interface box is a mic one jack, which is the microphone output to the audio mixer. Then there is an aux one jack, which is an audio input to listen to various audio feeds through the headphones. The headphone jack is the location to plug in the supplied headphones. Lastly is the power input where you connect the supplied wall pack transformer. On the bottom of the unit, there's a switch. Switch the unit to mic only when you want to listen to only the announcer through the headphones. Switch to mixed audio when you want to listen to other audio feeds through the aux one input from the audio mixer. In order for the muting circuit to properly mute the microphone, ensure you have phantom power turned on at your mixer. Refer to your audio control system manual for more information regarding turning phantom power on. An option that can be in lieu of the supplied gooseneck, microphone, and headphones is a single muff headset. This plugs directly into the XLR microphone input on the top of the interface and the quarter inch headphone input on the rear of the interface. This option provides many added benefits, such as it has greater ambient noise reduction, keeps the microphone at a consistent distance from the announcer's mouth, and it makes it easier for the announcer to listen to the sound coming out of the main system, but yet keeping an ear free to listen to what's happening around them. Thank you for watching this presentation. If you have further questions about our products, please contact a Dectronics audio representative. Feel free to view our other training videos available at www.dactronics.com forward slash support.